everyone welcome back to my channel so today's video we are going to be doing an unboxing of our monthly ipsy bag so this is the february box i do have i think it's called it's not the ultimate but it's not the bag so it's the one in the middle so <laughs> yeah before we get started, you guys know the drill. Go ahead and subscribe to my channel. Also, go ahead and turn on notifications so you guys can be updated every single time I upload. And also, follow me on social media. I'll have, like, the link or, like, my Instagram handle right here. So you guys can go ahead and follow me there. And without anything else, let's just get into the video. Actually, you guys, before we get started, I wanted to let you guys know that this might be my last Ipsy unboxing for a few months. And it's not because I don't like it or anything. I do, actually. I'm really bummed out that I'm going to, you know, just kind of pause it for a few months. But I just have so much makeup that I just kind of need to stop and just like stop you know i rather buy makeup than receive it monthly so i think i'm just gonna stop the ipsy unboxings for a few months but if you guys do enjoy these videos a lot then just tell me down below and maybe give this video a like and if it has enough likes then i guess i'll just continue it so we'll see i'm gonna leave it up to you guys and yeah so let's just get into it Alright, so the first item that we have is this Wonder Nude Illusion Liquid Foundation, and I have the shade Medium. I went ahead and I researched it, and I saw that Sephora and a lot of different places have it for $40, so this, this is a $40 foundation. So this is actually something really good um, to have in our Ipsy boxes. I haven't tried it. I think it will match me. Um, I feel like I'm going to do like a video recapping all of my Ipsy boxes to see how good the products are or something. So just keep in the lookout for that and I'll let you guys know sometime in the new near future if this is good. So we got that. Next up we have this palette and this is by Dominique Cosmetics. I've never heard of this brand before so... I don't know. I did research it and it says it retails for $15. Uh, we have all matte colors here. So I'm going to swatch this color since it's such a pretty, like, purpley shade. Can you see that? That's really pretty, really pigmented. Oh, that's actually really nice. So I might use it in an upcoming tutorial or something so did I mention this is $15 so just so you guys know it's 15 um it's an okay product I feel like it wouldn't be a palette that I reach for a lot just because they're all mattes and they're all like weird colors that don't really go together so this is kind of something that I would just pull out for like the blue shade or the pink shade but I mean, it's still nice, I guess. Next up, we have a lipstick. And we've already gotten one of these lipsticks. The last lipstick that we got by this brand, at least I got it, was, I believe, a really uh, deep... Sorry, I don't know what my hair is doing. Deep red color. And these lipsticks retail for $24. And I do believe it because it has really nice packaging. And they're very, very nice. I, w I wish they made it in like gold or rose gold because I don't really like silver. But I mean, they're really cool because they're like magnetic. So I do like that. I feel like they are worth the price. And this is the shade Three Plates. Wait. Yeah, Three Plates. Which I actually so happy I got this because it's kind of a pinky beige color. And it's something that I would definitely wear. So I'm excited about this because the other one, the one that I got before, which was the really like deep red, that's kind of a color that I wouldn't normally wear. But this one, I know I'm going to be able to wear it. So that's great. Uh, then we got an eyeliner and I'm kind of confused over this eyeliner because in one shop it said it was $20 and then in eBay it says it was $10. So I don't know what to believe. So I'm going with 20 but it might be 10. I don't know. So this is called the Il Macchiage. 
ink liner and I love getting eyeliners in my ipsy boxes because I cannot remember the last time that I bought an ipsy um, uh, lip, I was gonna say lip liner. <sighs> I cannot remember the last time that I bought an eyeliner, which is great. So this has kind of a really nice felt tip applicator. Oh, it's really nice. Oh, it's not, it's right there. I really like it. It's really nice and thin. Who I could... Now that I'm thinking about it, I could do a whole tutorial just using this stuff. I might do that. Really good. Okay. So then the last products that we got, which I'm actually really happy about, um, we got three masks. And they're all by this brand called Sweet Chef. I love doing masks. I at least do a mask once or twice a week, especially on Sundays. I do a mask. And I don't know, I just really like it. So the first one that we got is the Kill and Vitamin B Fresh Press Sheet Mask. And this says it hydrates and suits dry skin, which is especially for me because I have super dry skin. So this, this is great. Next up, we have the Ginger and Vitamin C. And this says it brightens dark spots and uneven tone. I feel like I sort of have an uneven tone. I don't know, what do you guys think? I don't know, I feel like this would be a good one too. Then the last one is Beet and Vitamin A, and it says it refines pores and smooths rough skin. Oh, that's, that's really good. I really like it. And again, I looked um, how much the price were, and they were $3. I was going to say $300. <laughs> they were $3.50 each. So overall, I paid $30 for this Ipsy box and I got a hundred and nine dollars worth of stuff so I mean Ipsy does good job I mean it's pretty good actually so yeah that's my Ipsy bag for the month of February remember if you guys did enjoy this video and you guys do want to see more Ipsy unboxings please let me know so that maybe I can keep going because I know that I already skipped the month of April but I'm already kind of regretting it so just let me know give this video a thumbs up let me not down let me know down below what kind of videos you guys want to see and yeah that's pretty much it thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys on my next video.